company squad. What the hell is going on guys? Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. So guys, we're picking it up back with a new video and this one's going to be very different from my usual videos because this one is very real guys. We're talking about a real thing that has happened in the Godfrey family. My full name is Kyle James Godfrey. If you guys didn't know Stromedy Squad and ever since I was a kid, both my parents and grandparents always used to tell me about the stories of my great grandfather who was an archaeologist, a world traveler. He literally went to every corner of the world collecting ancient artifacts valuables of all kinds and it was my parents that told me he ended up collecting so many valuable things and by the end of his life he had hidden them somewhere in the world apparently there's this book that he would write in like a diary and I never believed it but my grandpa used to say that he left clues in there that led to his treasures now throughout my entire life my my family's kind of seen this whole thing as a joke because nobody was actually ever able to figure out the clues unravel the mysteries but my grandpa is actually clearing out the house now. He's getting rid of a bunch of old stuff and he called my dad yesterday to let him know that he wanted to pass this book down that was written by my great grandfather. My dad literally said you could make a video out of it. So right now we're currently heading to my grandpa's house. We're going to go get this book and we're going to see if it's anything worth making videos about. Stromedy Squad, I know I make a lot of crazy content here on this channel, but this video is actually very real. This, like I said, this is a real part of my family history. Guys, as you can see, it is a beautifully day outside perfect tanning weather but also perfect for a freaking treasure hunt oh yeah it is so yo we got yana we got my brother here ethan do you remember when dad used to tell us about these stories about yeah the treasure like hunt and stuff? my grandpa used to tell us when we were younger that our great grandfather was an archaeologist he had all these crazy valuables we never believed any of it but i mean let's go check it out right all right so guys we're gonna head there right now we're actually meeting up with julian and mark as well we unfortunately have my boy alex behind the camera no no i'm, I'm just kidding i'm done with those jokes dude i'm done i'm sorry Wait, you i'm sorry matching. I'm look at you Oh. Oh my God, oh, oh, oh. We're changing oh, oh. first. Dude, and we're wearing the same black. Oh. Yo, it's actually kind of weird now. And we both have a backpack on. Yeah, we, didn't, we did not plan this. <laughs> All right, you guys. So we are going to go meet up with Julian, Mark, and I'll see you as we get closer to my grandpa's house. Yo. Yo, they just put out an extreme weather alert. Environment Canada has just issued a severe thunderstorm warning for this mobile coverage area. Take cover immediately if threatening weather approaches. And then, yo, look behind us. Yo, the weather's like chasing us. Yo, the vibes are already getting crazy. Yeah. And yo, apparently my grandpa's house, like all the electricity's out there. Wait, are you serious? And his house is like yeah. older and stuff. So Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> Look at this stupid guy. Look, he thinks he's so sick right now. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Dude, you ready to find some buried treasure? Where? There's only one way to find out. Yo! Oh. Look at the car. Yo, Stromedy Squad. So this storm that just went by was brutal. We didn't catch much of it on camera, but, but there's a ton of trees that have like crashed down. You can see one over here. Yo, they weren't kidding about that warning. Guys, it could not be a better day for a treasure hunt. Oh, look at that tree that fell. Yo, if you were standing there, that would not oh, be a good day for you. Over for you. Yo. Holy crap. Yo, look at this. Dude, this literally looks apocalyptic. I wish we caught this storm on camera. This thing was crazy. The whole road is blocked off. Yo, imagine this road here was the only way out and you lived on the other side of this tree. I'd be so mad. Stromedy Squad, drop a like down below for that tree. Rest in peace, tree. Yo, what if we pull up to my grandpa's house right now and there's a tree right through it? Oh my god. <laughs> that would not be a good start to that the video. That would not be good at all. That would probably be the end of the video. Hey, can I help you? Yeah, I'm looking for uh, Mr. Godfrey. Oh, uh, yeah, I think I just saw him go down there. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, just take a right and then go another thousand miles that way and you should find him. Oh, thanks. All right. Hope I never see you again, dude. Yeah, no that. one likes that kid. Yeah. All right, Stromedy Squad, and we are pulling up to my grandpa's house. You guys ready? Oh, let's check this out. Crazy. Guys, so we got the whole camera rig. We're taking this serious. All right, let's go. All right. I don't even know right now if this video is going to make it to the internet. This whole thing could literally just be a big hoax. Hey. How's it going? Are, are you guys moving stuff? Yeah, I'm just helping Papa or cleaning out a bunch of stuff in the really? house. He, okay. Yeah, he just wants to get rid of old stuff. He's yeah, got yeah, yeah. Okay, we got everyone here. We got all the equipment. Oh, and everything. Hey, hey guys, hi. Hey, hey, where, where's that Julian? book? Uh, it's in the basement. Yeah. It's in the basement? Yeah. Okay. I remember a long time ago looking at this book and uh, it was something to do with some treasure. He, yeah, didn't uh, you say, you, like, remember you used to tell me that you tried solving it when you were a kid? Yeah, I tried solving it because apparently it's like supposed to be some kind of treasure map or some kind of book of clues or something like that. He was like an archaeologist. Yeah. Where he traveled around the world collecting all these artifacts. And Yo. He put Wait. them in certain places. We don't know where they are. Oh my One God. spot or if they're in spread out. But he did it for safety and he was doing it for the family to look after us, I guess, in the future or to say, hey, this will be put away for you guys in the But we don't future. know if it's 100% true. We don't know if it's 100% okay. true. Okay, where, where's the book? Downstairs? It's in the basement, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, here. Come on through here. 
Yo, this is crazy. Okay, guys, we're in my grandpa's house right now. Apparently, it's downstairs. Hi, Papa. Hi. 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 Good How's to see you. Going? So you're moving some stuff right yeah, now? Yeah, that's right. Yes. Okay, okay. Yeah. Is, is that uh, that book's downstairs? Yes. That old creepy downstairs. one that you used yeah, to tell us about? You have to go down the stairs to the basement there. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Over here. Holy crap. So look at all these old books. This is what oh, we've been cleaning yeah, out. Yeah, I remember this. And so Stromedy Squad, when I was a kid, I used to come down here and look at all these, these like old books. And I specifically remember what that uh, my great grandfather's one looked yeah, like. Yeah. Yeah, it was like it was old, a small, it's yeah, a small, it was little small book, like really brown. Old. Is it? And it had a key on it. Remember? There was a key. Yeah, yeah, yeah there was a yeah, key. Yeah. yeah. I remember this book is real. Wait, is this it? No, that's not it. Recipes. Oh, oh yeah, that's not it. Like a string somewhere. Alright, so Stromedy Squad, somewhere. Somewhere. right now we're trying to find my great grandfather's book book that he left down here. I remember seeing it many years ago. It's really old looking and there's some uh, kind of Yo, everyone tried looking for it. Uh, is it one of So you said it's like a small video. Yeah. It looks like you, you don't think you would have moved video. it, right? No, I, I can't remember where I put it, but I think I put it over there somewhere. Okay, okay. Damn, guys, look at all this. Color or? So it was smaller than that. I remember it was smaller. It was smaller. It's kind of like this, but but it was thicker. What like color? pages were older. Wait, wait, guys, guys, guys. Yo. Is that it? Yeah, that's my, it? Yo, that's it! That's it! That's it! Yeah, that's the key. It's got a key. Yeah. Is this it? Yeah, that's right. Use it. Oh my god. He said there was some puzzle, like a treasure hunt puzzle or something in it. Yeah. We never solved it, okay? Yeah. And he just gave it to me one day. Here it is, and I'm passing it on to Andrew. So, this so, is and the I remember, book. I remember yeah. years ago looking at this book and thinking, wow, this is so cool. This is kind of like some kind of a treasure hunt. And, you know, we even started thinking, okay, we can do this. We can solve this. And so, look, if you open it up. I remember, I remember, I remember seeing this writing. It was like his diary. Yeah, it's of like a all his of all his adventures around the world, yeah. right? Something like this was stating something like uh, that he was uh, he was traveling around the world. He found this treasure. He wanted to put it in a safe place for everybody in the family. You know, we'll keep it hidden. Really? See, and there's even maps oh and stuff. Gosh. Yeah, this eyeball. That's so yeah, cool. it was really weird looking. Yeah, it's a bit so dusty all here. all these drawings in here have some sort of relevance to the treasure and the clues that lead up to it, right? Yeah. That's what we thought too. Wow. And we started. We thought as kids, me and my brothers thought, let's go take this out, see if we can figure it out, right? And it didn't make any sense to us. Strawberry Squad. Okay, this is. Intense. All right, yo, should we take it upstairs and try to read it? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Sure. Oh my gosh, like, let's do it. Yo, this thing looks so ancient. Like you'd find this kind of stuff in like only temples, dude. It's wrapped in this like old leather. See the amount of dust on this thing? It's like enough to fill the whole basement almost. What is this eye? Something like, about maybe like the Illuminati or maybe if we, oh, like yeah. Egypt, you know, at the top with the eye. It almost no looks idea. like a book of spells. It looks like something you'd find in one of those old antique stores, yeah. you know, auctions, and you'd buy it. Guys, it might be just a diary. You never know. <laughs> yeah, I remember reading some of this stuff. It's kind of uh, really faded, a little. Hope we can read it all. Yeah. Much yeah, this is crazy right now. I feel like I'm in one of those movies right now, like The Goonies or something. Yes. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> There's no way we're actually doing this right now. Guys, I've never been so excited about a like, video this before. It's literally a puzzle. Like, look at there's a puzzle on the table and there's a puzzle here in the book. <laughs> put it on the table so the Stromedy Squad can see. It says, uh, it's kind of hard to read some of this writing. It is the year 1976. And if you're reading this, then I would hope that your last name is Godfrey. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Because he only wanted the, the clues to be known to another person in the family. Family. Yeah, oh, so does that kept mean, like, in the family. Right now? <laughs> <laughs> no, you guys have like the ticket, you know? Okay, like I'm like yes, I'm like the ticket. Yes. But then we get all the prize rewards at the end. Should you not discover the secrets that I have left for you, I ask that this journal be passed down to the family until someone does. I'm 79 years old and I have seen better days of my life. Before my time comes, I made it a promise, promise. that to leave behind the many things I have discovered. Yeah, yeah. Because he yeah. was an archaeologist. He went around the world. He discovered many valuables. He gathered them all and then hid them somewhere, supposedly. Wow. Yeah. Might you and your... Sorry, I can't... Might, might you, you and your... Yourselves. Might you ask yourself, what is the point of all this? Sometimes things are meant to be kept the secret. This is hard, man. This is hard to read. Kyle, you read this. You read the rest <laughs> of it. I got it. I got it. Okay, it says, Findings that if ever found, others may have tried to steal it from me. It is important that enough time had passed for these discoveries to be forgotten. I can't bring them with me when I pass, so instead I shall have a pathway to where I have hidden them during my travels as a worldwide archaeologist. I had hidden clues in every corner of the world on as to how you should find this treasure. Only that of which holds this book shall Can understand... I shine a light for you? Yeah, yeah, that helps, actually. Many of the clues left. I could not make this easy for the fear that if this book is found in the wrong hands, the wrong person could find it. 
first. This was left behind and meant for the family only. My grandchildren were given a secret word that could only be shared with another blood relative. They may not know what it means now, but they will one day. I have instructed them to pass the word along to their children and so on until, until somebody is ready. The value of this at the time could be anywhere from one to two million United States dollars. Whoa. Oh what? Gosh. And yo, that was what? back in like 1970. So that, that would be worth like how much now? Like tens of millions. Yes. Oh, okay, if this is real, we got to find this. Oh, we got to find this. Now, now. Okay, so talking. now oh, we're talking. Now we're getting started. Okay, so let's not get too excited because we don't know 100% if this is real. Like you, you tried, that you read this and you tried figuring it yeah, out. Yeah, I tried figuring and, I mean, this out. We it can't be easy it. either. He's I remember this too. This is part of the first clue. This right here? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. It's kind of faded. So tall am I and most thin of all my concrete body. The rest I hope doesn't fall. What? The rest yeah. I hope doesn't fall, so it's a riddle of yeah. some kind. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, yeah, you guys know what that means? So tall am I and most thin of all, my concrete body, the rest hope I don't fall. Papa, did you know what that meant ever? No, and, no we never figured it out. Oh, I remember I like reading that, easy. but it's, yeah, it's maybe like a building or something. What? Co concrete. Yeah, like concrete, oh. tall, it could be like a, like it a, could be, you know, foam poles, like street poles. Like yeah, lightning, lightning, lightning something, pole. something thin no, though, a tree. It can be the tree? foundation of a bridge, like something concrete. Leading or like, like a power a, line. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Thing oh is, is, the thing is, is there's so many power lines, there's so many trees that that wouldn't pinpoint so exactly out? which what one. What is something that's really tall and like con like I don't know what stands out. It has to be something man-made because it's concrete, right? So it's like a building. Wait, in here in this area. But it's the rest hope I don't fall. What does that mean? So Stromedy Squad, right now, guys, we're trying to figure out the first clue that both my grandpa mm -hmm. and dad were never able to figure out. It, it, it might be some sort of monument to a famous person, you know, on a tall kind of column somewhere. Like a statue. Yeah, yeah. Like a statue. Statue. Oh. statue. Made out of concrete. But yo, he was a worldwide traveler, so this could be any monument anywhere in the world. It could be any landmark. Yeah, but I doubt he would start you off in any other location than your home, right? Guys, it's gotta be like a skyscraper or something. Okay, what's what super could? tall? What's it the tallest thing in-, some, like, in okay, wait, you said it was in 1976, right? Yeah. That was, that was when he first, he wrote that first clue. 1976. Yeah, he says, is it, is it the year? It is the year 1976. Yeah. Okay, wait, wait, wait. How? You are reading. So it can't be any new monuments. No, it's gotta be something yeah, from pre-1976. Wait, 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 the CN Tower. Look. It was actually built February 6, 1973 is when it yeah, started. And so it makes sense because it's like, so tall am I. The CN Tower is the tallest building in tall Toronto. Building. Yeah. And most Canada. thin of all, it's the thinnest structure in Toronto. Yeah. Whoa. And it's my made concrete, of concrete body. Yes. It's made of concrete and the yeah. rest hope I don't fall. As in the other buildings. The other buildings hope it doesn't fall. Yeah, Wait, so what if he put like a clue in like the foundation or something of yeah. the CN Tower that's, while it was being built? That's what I'm saying. It's got to be something to do with the CN Tower. Or like maybe we have to be on top of the CN Tower to understand the next part of the book. Oh, because if we're at the very top, we'll be able to see literally the whole city. Exactly. Stromedy Squad, we're thinking that the first clue could actually take us to the CN Tower, which is the highest structure in all of Canada. It looks like this. And it's about 25 minutes away. Should we go? Yeah, yeah. let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, guys, so we're typing in the CN Tower. It's about 15 minutes away from this spot. But it's like, once we get to the CN Tower, we don't know what we're looking for exactly. Well, we don't know, and your grandpa said he never saw anything there, and he's been there multiple times. Okay, but you remember there was that page with the eye, right? Yeah. yeah. So what if, like, what if we have to look for something with an eye in it? You know what I mean? I'm the sure bottom. there's something in the book that will give us an idea on what we have to look for I once mean, we're up there. The thing so is, we don't even know if we have to go to the top or if it's something around the maybe, bottom yeah, of the maybe. tower. I find it kind of interesting, though, that you would hide the clue in the CN Tower because that's like a main place for tourists to go and right and it's like you would such figure a public that, place. yeah you would figure that someone would be able to find it yeah, by now any clue that he did leave there somebody must have already found it yeah. in the last 50 years even if they didn't know what it was You mean to tell me the next clue is up in that thing? Julian, you've never even been up the CN Tower. Yeah, I've right? never even been up there that thing. Bro, look at how high it is. It's the biggest yeah. building. Look like why would you even want to go up that bro? That Quite thing massive. is massive. Wait, Yo, did you say just up there? Yeah. Dude, that thing's in the sky, my guy. So tall am I? Was definitely right. You don't realize how tall it is unless you're at this angle. Dude, that thing is big. But you want to know what else is big? Oh, I do. Nah, cut that, cut that, <laughs> cut that. I was going to say the Stromedy Squad. They're big, you know? It's a, like a big uh, amount of people. Yeah, yeah. One thing you'll learn on this channel, guys, is you never follow Julian. This definitely doesn't look like the right way, dude. I think we're low-key, yeah, like, oh, it's a dead end. Oh yeah. my god. Wait, can you just get across? Like, Let's just do some parkour. Yeah, Julian. Yeah, it's great, guys. It's a shortcut. Yeah? 
You just have to climb up this thing and then yeah. do some Spider-Man stuff and you'll be good. Guys, Toronto is packed right now. Yo, what if all these other people are looking for my grandfather's treasure? That would mean like already thousands of people have beat us to the first clue. At least we have the advantage of the book, unless there's like multiple. I don't think there is though, right? Mark, that's gotta be the dumbest thing you've ever said. <laughs> Mark, yeah. can, I, can I seriously trust you with that book right now? Oh my gosh. You're dude. not gonna lose that? I'm two-handing it. All right. Cool. Look at the only about Should we take the stairs? I'll meet you there, let's go. Is there even stairs, bro? <laughs> could you imagine how long it would actually take to climb up there, bro? All right, Stormity Squad, we're making our way into the tower. I gotta be super low key about the camera because the security is high in here, but I'll let you know when we're on the elevator making our way to the top. Was security asking you about the book? Yeah, dude, they were like really sketched out about it. They were like, why do you have this? Like, what is it? It does look messed up. Okay, no, like, nobody but... carries around a book yeah. like that. Bro, the guy, he's like asking me, he's like, what, what kind of book is this? I'm like, bro, this is a book. Like, yeah, it's like a regular book. He's like, can you open it? I'm like, taking out the key, I'm like, ra unwrapping it. Like, but I didn't want to show her like the pages because I was worried, like, what if they know about, you know? The... But I'm surprised the security didn't say like looking for the treasure too. Everyone is gonna. Yo, be imagine. Yeah, yeah. Guys, we are waiting in the line right now to go up the elevator that's gonna take us to the top, and then hopefully there's something in the book that will show us our next step when we get to the top. And just like that, guys, we made it into the elevator that's gonna take us to the top. Oh. That is Yo, this thing actually Yo. sends you up, dude. This is a it actually sends you up fast. Okay, we we have to hope that the next part of the clue is at the top. Yo, this is. Yo, it's still going? Does it have something to do with this cutout or is this just like a rip know. of something? Yo, guys, keep an eye out. Look out into the city. Look for landmarks that are maybe in the oh shape God. of that I'm cutout. I'm scared of the height, Kyle. Yo, is this the... Oh! Yo, 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 I'm not standing on that. Yo, knowing my luck, that's definitely gonna break. Yo, Julian, come on, dude. Come on. Yo, Julian, Julian. Yo, just have a peek, dude. Have a peek. It's not that, it's not that bad. Bro, it's not. Penis, I'm sweating, bro. There you go. Get this thing over. Right, right, right. Where's the book? Let's find where we need to go because I'm sweating. <laughs> yo, this view is crazy. Okay, so yo, guys, we gotta figure out the next clue. Look for landmarks. Look for landmarks. Anything that could resemble that page in the book. Yo, pull it out. Maybe, maybe it has something to do with this shape right here because that doesn't look like a rip. That looks like it was intentionally cut out in a certain yeah, way. Because yeah. there's an outline with a marker around yeah, it. As exactly, well. exactly. What if it's like something over here? One of these like boards, like you see far in the distance, like the yeah, it's gotta be like a building that? of some kind. I don't think it's a building because it's sideways. Does the eye have any sort of significance? Maybe it's something uh, to do with our eye. Maybe if you look through it or maybe, maybe like look through it and try to... Like this way or this way? Definitely that, that way. way. Yeah. Like line it up with, with one of the landmarks Yo, outside. Be careful though. We don't want to like expose anything for any other people. Yeah, yeah we also want... We don't want anyone like catching on to the fact that we're looking for this treasure. Okay, yeah. Uh, like see, does it line up with anything? Dude, Let me I don't see. know what it could maybe line like up a with. Let me oh, see like any of, the, any of the buildings in maybe the background or something. Or something. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the clouds are constantly changing. That doesn't They're make bad. any sense. Yeah, my bad, my bad, my bad. Wait, yo, yo. What about the, uh, what about the island? Oh. What about the island? Uh, does it line up? Yo. It actually kind of does, Does dude. that line up? Dude, it does. Okay, let me see. No, no, Here, let me it see. does, it does, Let me see, let me see, let me see. Oh, yo. Oh, oh, it does, yo. yo, that lines up perfectly. Do you see that? Yeah, that thing lines up with the water right there. Yeah, it goes in perfectly. Yo, that has to be it. That island is the exact same shape as the cutout in the book. And that's why they have the eye there. It's like you're supposed to look eye through land. it. Island. Yeah. Island. Yeah, either that or like we're supposed to look through it. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, or both. But if it really is the island, that island is massive. It looks small from up here, but when we're on there, it's going to take hours to cover that whole thing. What, what exactly are we looking for yeah. once we get on the island? Maybe, maybe we're missing like a part of the clue or something. Is there anything further? Does it have above? anything to do with this riddle at the top? Twisted Pass and Thorny Hedges, the entrance and exit are both on the edges. Many choices and dead end salvation is found if you stick with your friends. Well, there is a lot of greenery there, so thorny edges might make sense, but maybe I feel like, like maybe the edge of the island. I don't know, but yo, we only have like three hours until sunset. I say we go to the island and ask some of the locals on that island if they have any ideas on as to what this riddle could mean. All right, All right let's go, let's go, let's go. Yo, there's only one problem. How are we gonna get to the island? We're, we're gonna need like a boat or something. Or let's, oh, I saw some boats. Let's go on a ride no, no, mark no, over no, there. No, no, okay. No, no, no. Kayak? No, no, no. Yeah, we can't hey, kayak no, all the way. We're way too I far. I know a guy. Trust me, I know a guy. All right, he'll bring us there. Come on, let's go. Follow me. All right, you guys, so there is the island. So we just need to find a boat, some someone that can take us over the water there. We don't 100% know what we're gonna be looking for once we get to the island, but it has something to do with that riddle. Maybe once we get there, something will stand out to us and we'll be able to connect the pieces of the puzzle. Yo, is it this thing that we're taking? It's my guy, man. Yo. No roof, no wall. Yo, look, it even has a pirate, like a pirate flag oh, on top. Cool. Yo, 
Yo. All right, guys, so we are stepping onto the boat that takes us to the island. Yo, the craziest part about all this is the fact that my great-grandfather did all this to set up the treasure hunt. All right, you guys, so we're downtown Toronto and not even two steps into this massive supposed worldwide treasure hunt. We're already being taken on a pirate ship that takes us to Toronto Island where supposedly the next clue lies. Yo, Where's the book? Oh, right here, I have it. Okay, yo, we need to figure out this riddle because once we get to the island, we're not gonna have any idea where we're going. We're going there blindsided right now. Bro, and literally the captain just said there's three points on the island, so we don't even know where to go. Could my great grandfather be any less specific? So what I gotta wonder is, which one did he tell you about? Which treasure? Yo, so have you heard about any clues on this island that lead to a treasure? You know what? They found something suspicious a couple of weeks ago. If you go out to the big pier where you can see the whole lake and you hang a right towards the haunted lighthouse, on that beach, found some weird stuff. Okay, we don't know if that has any relevance oh. to our, our specific hunt. But, like I always say guys, there's only one way to find out. We are currently on the way to the island right now. You guys can see the city in the background. Hopefully we're onto something here. Yo, dude. Yeah. Have you ever seen this riddle here? Twisted paths and, and thorny hedges. The entrance and exit are both on the edges. Many choices and dead ends. Salvation is found if you stick with your friends. Never heard it before, but all those words ring to me like there's a church for salvation at the end of the twisty path after the bridge. Yeah. And there's a bunch, there's a maze near there where all the, the water fountains are. There's so a that maze? Could, that could be the entrance and exit they're talking about. Oh yeah, yo guys, he pointed out the maze. The maze on that the makes island. sense, it could be the maze because thorny path and thorny edges, the entrance and exit are both on the edges. It makes sense. Hold on to that. Okay, okay. All right, you guys, and we have just about made it to the island. Good luck guys, stay safe out there. All right, you guys, so we officially made it to Toronto Island and this, this place dude. is huge, bro. How are we gonna find this? <laughs> this thing is literally 10 miles wide. Bro. Dude, it's like, how are we gonna pinpoint exactly which spot we're supposed to look for this clue? Well, we There's probably a million hedges. Thorny bushes, right? Ends, and Something like the to guy do was sticking telling us. with your friends. And the maze is what we have to find too, right? So maybe we have to go through the maze together because a common mistake would be that, you know, usually a group would split up. Yeah, 100%. All right, which way do you think the maze would be? Yo, do you guys know where a maze is? A maze on the island? No. <laughs> Thanks for nothing. Oh yeah, there's a map of the whole place. Okay, so uh, where we're are we right, right now? We're, we're right here. Okay. And he said, he said at the end of the Oh, pier. yo, 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 look, look, look. Oh. William Meany Maze, right there. You see that? Meany? William Meany Maze. Dude, That's okay, probably so it. Maybe yeah. like at the center of that maze is the next clue. It's a five minute walk. Five minute walk? Okay, that shouldn't be too far. Okay, so that's up that way. All right, yo, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yo, dude. Yo, have you seen a maze over there? Keep going that way, over the bridge. Yeah? Okay, okay, yo. They said over the bridge, over the bridge. Yo, this must be the bridge here. Is that the maze right there? Yeah. Whoa, that's amazing. <laughs> All right, who's going in first? We don't even know what we're looking for. You're already breaking yeah, yeah, yeah. the rules. Hold on, hold on. There's no going in first. We well, it says all salvation is found if you stick with your friends. Exactly. So okay. we have to all go in together. Okay, so together. Okay, wait, wait, wait. What else did the rules okay, say? Okay, let's open it up and see. Because I'm not just trying yeah, to walk open up the maze book. like aimlessly. Let's figure out what we I'm, need. I'm assuming you got to get to the, the center or something. There might be no, a clue there, like the a edge, lever, a edge? pedestal, like something under the ground that we need to dig up. Twisted path. And thorny hedges. The entrance and exit are both on the edges. I mean, duh, it's a maze. Choices and dead ends. Solution is found. Salvation. Oh. Solutions? <laughs> Solutions, my guy? Why couldn't my great grandfather have just given us the treasure and called it a night? Why do we gotta go like hunting for it like this? He just wants oh, to like he learn through the process, you know? And earn it. You, we gotta yeah. go to all the places. But yo, you know what? I have a really good idea. What? Yo, whoa. Oh, Less on the popsicle oh, and more on the clues, yo. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, no, Nate. Yo. Enjoying that. That was. You'll be fun. just fine. You'll make. All right, yo, we're wasting time. Let's go. Okay, yo, which direction? So what? What are we looking, looking for, for, though? Yeah, exactly. Wait, no, Alex, yo, Alex, you gotta come in here, dude. Yeah, let me know what, you find. what? Yo, we gotta stick together. Remember? Yeah. It says salvation is found if you stick with your friends. Yeah. I wouldn't really say you guys are my friends. That was that was kind of me. All right, guys. So thorny hedges, something thorny hedges, and entrance and exits. Hedges. Yeah. yeah, I have no idea what we're looking for, but yo, what I do know is this is looking sick. Yo, this isn't much of a maze. Like I could literally just no, hop out right there. Dude, I think <laughs> this is kind of pathetic, actually. Holy crap! Yo, one thing we want to make sure is that we don't get lost in here. We don't know. We don't know 100% how big this thing is. Kyle, there's so many dead ends. I'm genuinely lost. Guys, if somebody finds this footage at any point after... Oh, is that a dead end? It's literally a dead end. Just know that we died in this maze and we never made it out. Yo, like I hear other people in here too, but I'm not seeing anybody. Oh, wait, yo. This looks like the center of the maze here. Yo, I think this is the center wait, right why here. why does it yeah. look broken into? I don't know, but like this is clearly not the way to get in because the fence is here. Julian? Yo, yo where are you guys? Yo, 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 yo. yo. There yo. you are. Yo, yo. Did you guys see anything? Yo, there's nothing in here. I don't know what, what we're I mean. looking for. I think this is just 
a dead end in itself, honestly. I think we gotta get to the center point here. How do you get into there? Yo, maybe loop back around. There's gotta be a way to get into that center part. I have a feeling side. whatever we're supposed to be looking for is in there. Yo, follow me. I think it's this way, guys. Trust me. I know exactly where I'm going. When in doubt, just, just follow me, guys. Don't worry about it. They're everywhere. Jesus Christ. Yo, I found it. Yo, this is it right here. This is the center of the maze. I mean, there's nothing here, though. This it's is the center. center of the earth. So, yo, where, what are we supposed to be looking for? There's gotta be something here that points us in the right direction. It says twisted so paths and thorny, thorny hedges. 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 You think maybe we should be looking in the hedges then? Yeah, if it's Yeah, like, like inside the hedges. Guys, guys, check inside the hedges. It's gotta be something about the hedges. Like, there's gotta be something nothing somewhere. Nothing yet, nothing yet. Check, check like above the hedges. Like, maybe it's underground. Over here. Yeah, like, nah, I, I think the... that's just part of the, the maze, dude. Let me see this lock. Dude, that's just like a regular lock. They wouldn't have had that kind of a lock back then in 1976. Yeah. That's when he wrote it, right? You guys check over here? We checked everywhere. Yo, I don't know. Maybe it's not in the center of the maze. Maybe it's somewhere around it because they said multiple entrances and exits. Maybe it's another exit that leads to a secret passageway of some kind, you know? What? Yeah. Wait, yo, yo, yo. Huh? Did you hear that? I yeah. hear your foot stopping. Look, yo, this is low. Oh, oh, go back. Go back to that yeah, spot. Yeah, yeah. Go back. Go back. That that's making like a different sound. It's like hollow. What? Check in the middle. What is that? There's yeah, this thing. Dude, move that. There's what is that? There. Yeah, what is that, dude? Wait, yo, what is yo. It? Holy. That's Whoa. like a chest. Yo. Dude. What is it? It's like a. It's, it's like, like a, a like a symbol of some kind. It looks yeah. like a like a Y. What, what could that mean though? Yo, pull it up. Bro, it looks like a freaking rocket ship or something. No, it's, maybe it's supposed to represent the CN Tower. Since yeah, it just came from there. Wait, maybe maybe there's something about that in the book. Wasn't there like wasn't there a symbol of this? Wasn't this exact same symbol in the book? It's hard Let's to see. Know which Yo, way. check check check. Uh, behind the eye. Behind uh, the eye. Behind the eye. Yeah, right there. That's it, dude. Oh. That thing. Wait. Yeah. So. Dude, so that's what is exactly that? That's the exact it. same symbol. Uh, I don't know. It's there's is a there any, wait, but look the shape. The shape that we looked through. The shape that we looked through from behind almost looks like a bird because these look like wings. And this looks like a head. Yeah, exactly. And it's like birds. Guys, do you have any eye? Birds eye view. Bird eye view. Of what? Yeah, yeah. Birds eye view of so this. So maybe this. But how does that? But how does that? Tower then. Yeah, but how is that relevant tower. to this? It doesn't make sense. What's the bird's eye view? I don't know. Could huh? this be like the island that we're on? Should we get the drone well, no, up here and see maybe if you can see anything from a bird's eye view? I mean, I did. I did bring the drone with me. Is there anything written on there? Is there anything written on it? Like, I mean, if anything was written on it, it might have got, might have faded after the, all those years. You know oh, what I'm saying? Kyle. I mean, there's this, but like, yeah, but that's not what does that, that mean? Writing? It's just an X? Is it a cross or an X? Well, it's I definitely would assume an X. it's like, an X. Like X marks the spot type of thing. Wait, X marks. We wouldn't have been able to find the treasure that fast. Or no, maybe, this... wait, which way was this pointing? Wait, you think we already found? The wait, treasure? it was pointing this way. Maybe the treasure's like buried right here or something. Like, I don't know, but I feel like if it's saying right here, then it's at the end of whatever this is. So we need to take the drone but up. But then it says birds. Yeah, it says birds eye view. Of you, so we need to get up in the sky. Only way we can get in the sky, drone. drone. All right, let me put the drone up. All right, Stromedy Squad, we're gonna put the drone up and just try to see if we can get any clues on the island on as to what this is. Because as you guys saw, the book had a picture of a bird and an eye, so maybe we can get a better idea of what this is from the air. All right, Stromedy Squad, and we officially have the drone up oh, in the air. Oh, you guys oh, can oh, see oh, the, maze. the entire maze wow. from the drone's perspective. That is absolutely insane. Okay, but we don't care about the maze. What we do oh, care about is something on this island to be relevant to the symbol that we found, which is this. If you forgot. Clearly having a bird's eye view of the island has some sort of significance to figuring out the clue. So we're probably gonna be looking for something that has that shape, right? Yeah, but I'm not mm. noticing anything so far. What about that building? It could be honestly Dude, there are so many so things, many things yeah, so in many, this like, island. Dude, look at the city in the background. Yeah, wow. Damn. That looks absolutely it, insane. Maybe it's like okay, the what water. what are we looking for? It yeah, it has to be a body of water. water. Or, yeah, maybe it's the way that the land is shaped with the yeah. water. And then it would probably be at this point within that, that shape bridge? that we'd yeah. have to go searching, right? Yeah, like what about the bridge we went over. Yeah, you maybe I check go the bridge? higher. It's in there. Yeah, I mean, going higher won't help me too much. So Holy, look the city more looks crazy. Down because it's bird's eye view. What if, what if whatever it is e isn't even on this island? Strawberry yeah, Squad, bridge. if you guys have oh. noticed, what if it's a train track where it splits off into two? Oh. You know, that makes sense. Yeah, like or a pathway. Yeah, this sidewalk. Kinda looks like yeah, yeah, that kind of looks yeah. like it right there. Little bit. Yeah, but it's not close enough. Well, okay, so what we're trying to find is an, uh, a landscape that matches that shape exactly. So yeah, keep an eye out for anything that looks like that. What about over here? It looks like a lot of like weird types of symbols. Yeah, Why are there so many cool. like, different shapes? It's so weird. Oh, oh what? wait. Whoa, go, 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 right go, go. Yo, dude, Kyle. That looks exactly, exactly it. like it. Yeah. Dude, that Let's is see. it. Let me see. Look, oh, yeah. yo, bird that, eye. That's got to be it. That is it, dude. Strawberry oh, Squad, look, that's the exact same shape right there. That looks exactly like it, and the X is here. So the next clue, so if the X is on the end of this thing, that must mean that the clue is where the pier connects to the land. Yeah, it's like, under, like right under here. Let me see if oh. I can see anything there. It looks like a beach. Hold on, let me see if I can see anything under there. Oh, what if it's under there somewhere? Yeah, I don't want to lose signal. I think it's better if we go over there and check it out. Let's go. Now that we know it's there. wait.
Yo, Pierre's over this way. Yo, come on. Yeah, it's right over there. It's right over there. Yo, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yo, the sun's going down too. We don't have much time to find this last clue. We gotta get off this island because the ferry, they stopped working, working in like the next two hours. All right, so the X is, it's should the be X right is right here. here and relative to the pier, we're standing on the spot where the next clue should be. Guys, check the boards. Yeah, check the boards. Maybe there's something engraved, but the thing is, is over 50 years? What's this? Dude, there's nothing What's this right here? I can't even read that. Yo, 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 yo. I don't think it would be something to do something on the board. Yeah, no, it wouldn't be like right here because then like anybody could pick yo, it up. This stuff in here is edged in pretty hard, man. What is that? Look at how deep these are edged in, bro. This looks literally okay. like 30, 40 what years does it say? old. Turner. Is this Turner. something to do with the, the clue? Like, look, there's so many different markings on here. There's got to be something. Or, a bunch it, of shallow water here or maybe it's from this spot that you can Yo. see. What? What if it's underneath the bridge? I see a soft water. Underneath the bridge? Yeah. What how do we like get down there? What if it's like buried under the rocks? What if you need to swim under? Oh, no. I don't want to do that. Well, maybe it's on the beach side. Maybe it's on yeah. this side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it could be under. It could. Yo, go, go, go. Squad. We're thinking that the next part of the clue could be underneath the pier. Yo, I don't see anything. It has to be here. There's literally nowhere else it will be. Yo, but, like, but the, guys, listen. The problem is, is this water, the water levels raised over the that's, years. That's what I was going to say. And yeah. maybe it's covered the beach where originally my, my great-grandfather would have buried the clue. Like, what if it actually extended out to those rocks? Think about it, bro. If, if the X is at the end of the dock, Dude, right? Dude, X if it was at, the okay, spot, if it was at the end grandma? of that spot, 100% it's in the water. But here, we have a chance that it's either at the end of this dock under here somewhere. You see, look, look, look. Yeah. You see, you see right behind here, there's like a little... Yeah, see? Yeah. Look, look, look behind Behind the dog, you see how there's like a little thing underneath it. Yeah, yeah. Let me ch let me check in there. Someone needs to be able to crawl in there. <sighs> It's got to be something under here. Do you think it could be under the water? I don't under know. Rock? Like maybe over there behind that pillar. Because that's still technically the, the beginning of the pier. Yo, everyone start flipping the rocks upside down. Look look under the rocks. It's got to be under the oh, rocks, right. under no something problem. here. No, no chill. Not that one, one Mark. Yeah. I don't think my oh, grandfather okay. would have been able to lift that either. Sure. I'm going to take off my shoes. Water? Or you're going you're gonna to go in the water? The water level's risen. It's got to be under the one of the rocks in there. Oh my god, you really... It, it has to be. Okay, okay. All right, guys. Start lifting up rocks. I see anything, this is dude. so cold. Oh, whoa. 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 Relax! God damn! Yo, do you see anything, Kyle? Nah, I'm trying to lift up everything. I'm trying to see if I can see anything like sticking out of the rocks. Maybe underneath. that flat one right there? Huh? Maybe that big flat one right there? Yeah, I don't know. It's too heavy though. That thing's way too heavy. Oh, do you see anything? I got nothing. Oh, yo! Yo! Yo, yo, yo! What? No, no, no. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wait, Ethan, pass the camera? What the hell is this? You really want to throw oh. it? Oh. Yo, what's what's this in here? It's like two holes oh here. God, you're back into it. Oh Probably nothing, huh? Guys, <laughs> what? Guys, there's, there's like something here. What? Where? Behind Mark. Dude, there's like an X here or something, but I'm not sure. Can you get there's down? And, I don't know. I think here, I saw Mark. an X. Here, Mark. Yeah. Here, get the hell out of here. I one sec. Hold on. What are you talking about? There's an X here. Go, bro. Where? Oh! Wait, yo, 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 Julian. Yo, come here. Yo, look at this. Yo, there's an X there, just like the X on that uh. Wait, wait, wait. wait. On, on the oh, on, on the, the pier-shaped wood thing. Are you sure? Pole, are you well, sure dude, it's the same X? Well, dude, what else is that? Wait, I don't know. Like the treasure's like cemented in this. Maybe it means dude. Maybe it's like under all these rocks here. You have to move all this. Is it the treasure or is it another clue? I think it's too easy. Julian, dude, I'm gonna need your help. Start moving this. Donna, great job bystanding. Thank you. What if it's like all the way down there, bro? Try to move these, dude. Holy, yo, these are heavy. Yo, we're never gonna be able to lift these. Guys, what if it's like under all these? Yo. Guys, three Wait, rocks down. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, 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 yo. yo. What is it? Yo, there's something here. Yo, there's like a box. Pull it out. There's a box. Yo, oh. check this out. Yo. Oh, it's like soaking wet. Dude, why is it wet? <sighs> Yo. Bro, you think this is it? You think this is something? Yo, this has to be it, 100%. Kyle, bring it up to the rock. Okay, okay, go, 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 go. Bring it up to the beach. Yo, this has to be it right here. There is a Yo. box. Wait. Right, open it. Dude, dude, this looks super old, Dude, too. it looks like a shoe box. What, what kind of century are you living in? No, but That's like a an old box? age shoe hey, hold on. Oh, true, just, true. Let me get my freaking pants, all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. First things first. Okay, while he's gone, we might as well get into hey, Mark, it. Go, chill out. Chill, 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 relax, why, why, bro. Why, why, why? Wait for him. If it's his grandfather who did this, like, he's got to do it, man. Maybe we could get, like, a family curse or something if we open it. Mark isn't trying to open the treasure over there is he no he's not no no, no. Yes, yes. why would i do that i'm not trying to like you know take away this whole thing Mark, between you and your grandpa guy, what do you think it'd be in here dude the treasure maybe? yeah it's like the actual treasure yeah it can't be it's not that big. maybe the next clue how do you, maybe it's like a check for like a million how do you open dollars this? Oh, that. how do you open yo 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 wait. whoa wait it's just a piece of paper wait is that sage that's not know. just a piece of paper 
Yo, this is another clue. Yo, oh, yo. yo, it's another clue. Hundred percent, that's what it is. Oh, go oh, this thing has to be like 30, 40 years old, yeah, bro. This thing's been sitting Dude, in that box forever. Here, Yana, open this. Okay. You see? Yo, no freaking way we actually found this, dude. All right. Your dad is gonna... What if it just said, you've been pranked, April Fools? <laughs> I'd be like, huh? Excellent. Wait, huh? what? Oh, it's a puzzle that we, we gotta solve? Man. Yeah. Some sort of like writing or something. Wait, what? Whoa. Yo, what kind of language is that? I don't know, it's like Yeah, it's like some old like ancient language of yeah. some kind. Wait, what? dude, we have to find a way to like decode wait, it. Wait, yo, wait, where's the book? Yo, go to the last page. I think I remember seeing those like, those same symbols. Wait, these? Maybe they can help us like decode everything. Very last page of the book. Oh, yo, oh. right wait, there. Dude. Okay, wait. Yo, those are the same Take symbols. That that's the translation. So this is a code. We just have to uncode so it. So we have yo. to decode this using this in order to yes, get to the next level. Yes, set the book level. down. Set the book down okay, and okay. and and the scroll. Okay, let's see. Okay. okay so All right. This? So that is uh, which okay. which one is that? This one or no, is it? No, it's no, uh, it's, uh, it's one? S. Uh, S S. Okay, somebody write this down, Ethan. Do you have your phone? Yeah, 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 guys, this is getting more intense. Look at look at this scroll. This thing looks like it's been around for decades. It even burned a little. Yeah. Bit. Guys, the, I got S. guys, the next okay, one is S? W. Right. w. No M M M. Oh, M, M. Sorry, I'm upside down. Right. <laughs> Mark, you're an amateur, dude. Okay, right, so, so S M, S, M uh, triangle O, o right there. Okay. This K. one uh, is right here. K. Smoke. smoke. S M O K. K. Or smoke. And then we got. Smoke, no, with the E, okay, so oh, smoke. smoke. Look, Y, smoky. Y's right okay. there, smoky, okay. Ah, oh, some of it's burnt out that's though. A, that looks like an H. Uh, yeah, H, okay. Uh, what I was this, it was burnt out, but it looks like a triangle. Tip of a triangle. So well, it could oh. be this one, yeah, or it could be the... I think we should just go on with the other letters and then come back to it. Maybe we'll be able to figure Yeah, exactly, out. we can just fill yeah. in the blanks. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Uh, this? This is like... So look, we got K. Looks like an L, L. L? Two L's. So, wait, so... Hall. Hall. O, w, w, hollow, 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 smoky, smoky. What do you have? All right, so I have smoky, and then H two L's. H double L. Hollows. Smoky hollows. This has got to be an O. Smoky hollows. Smoky hollows. What's that? Yo, that's a that's a conservation park. Where? Yeah, in in uh. It's in uh Waterdown. Dude, that's our next step. Yeah, with uh. It has the waterfall and everything. That's gotta be where the next clue is. Oh, we have to make our Smoky way there. Hollows. Smoky Hollows. That's like it. That's like an hour away from here. That's that's not too far. Yo, should we head there? Okay, Stromedy Squad. We think we have this figured out. We just translated the message from the book. This that's a clear sign that you need to have the book in your possession in order to solve these clues. Well, there's no way if somebody didn't have this, they would know what any of these mean. We think we have it sorted out, Stromedy Squad. Smoky Hollows. That is this spot right here on the map. There's a waterfall there which is the only landmark that stands out so maybe it's something to do with that waterfall all right let's head there guys come on let's go let's go let's go let's go let's go All right, guys, and we just caught the last taxi out of Toronto Island with the clue that we needed to continue this hunt. All right, you guys, so going to outro the video here, we're heading back to the city, and then from there, we're gonna head to the Smoky Hollows, which we believe to be the next point of interest for the next clue in this hunt. Guys, if you enjoyed this, make sure to drop a like, hit that subscribe button, check out everybody the down bell, below. man, ring the bell! Woo! In the description. I'll see you guys in the next one to continue the hunt, and as always, peace!